Okay, on this one, it says a researcher used a chi-square test for independence where the two variables were eye color and hair color and a p-value this was produced. Then the researcher conclude at the 0.05 level that the eye color and hair color are independent. Is that true or is that false? Well, to, to, be, to answer that question, we've got to go look at the test for independence in the notes. And what does it say? So I'm going to go to the notes here with you. Find the notes. Um, if I can find them. Well, I, I don't think I have them right here. Let me just pop them in for you down here. Let's pop them in down here. It's not them. There it is. Okay. So here it is. This is the exam for notes. Test for independence. What do you do? HO is independent, H1 is dependent. Let's write that out first off. So HO is independent. H1 is dependent. Okay. And so what, what did the p-value? The p-value came out to be super low. 0. 0.0001. And the alpha level is 5%, 0.05. So most definitely this is less. And what does that mean? If the P is low, P is less than alpha, HO must go away, meaning reject HO keep H1, right? Reject H is a bye-bye HO, keep H1. So we conclude they're dependent. What did it say? Independent. No, 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 that's false, right? If the P is low, HO must go away. Reject HO, keep H1, dependent. They said independent, false. There we go.